Hey guys, Greg Ever here. Uh, with me today, special Danielle Wellahoski, formerly Durante. Um, Danielle, say hi. Hi guys. All right, so the two questions that everybody wants to know. Number one, Good. why are you so explosive? And number two, how tall are you? Okay. <laughs> Uh, number one, I did gymnastics for many, many years. So uh -huh. I think that has something to do with it. And number two, I'm 4'11". There we go. <laughs> I'm a little under five feet. Perfect. Perfect for weightlifting yes. on both counts. The one thing that's not perfect, which we're going to see right here, is your ankle flexibility. Yes, Although that one turned out to be totally fine. So uh, what's going on with your ankles here? Uh, they're super tight. I don't know if it's my years of gymnastics or... Years of weightlifting. <laughs> Too much bouncing around. Yeah. So I've, I've probably talked about it on previous videos, but you can see, oh, there's that crazy leg. You can see with Danielle, a lot of times when she's sitting in the bottom of that squat, especially with the snatches, you can see her shins just getting pushed back uh, because of her ankle tightness. So that, that bottom position gets really difficult. And uh, so obviously we're working on a lot of that stretching, making her hold that bottom position. So you see a lot of her snatches on the video. She sits in the bottom for what seems like an eternity. It's not because she wants to. It's because I told her to. So, I mean, do you feel like that stuff has helped? Do you feel like you're making some improvement? Uh, yes. Huge progress, I think. Um, I haven't been able to sit in ever in any of my lifts. So. <laughs> No one was just mean enough to you yet. I was more power movements, so. Yeah, so clean and jerk. Well, actually, first of all, I know what my guess is, but what's your favorite lift out of the snatch, the clean and the jerk? I love the snatch. And really? I, well, I was okay. going to guess Let jerk. Me, jerk first, then snatch. Okay. <laughs> so, for those of you who follow regularly, you probably have noticed Danielle has basically like a textbook jerk, except when she gets a little crazy and throws her head forward. Um, no, that's just a pull moment. I thought she was about to clean and jerk that. So, worst part, like what's the hardest part for you of any of these lifts? Uh, the cleans, finishing my second pole and sitting in. Oh, and so like, why do you think that is? Do you get psyched out because of the weight off the floor or what is it? Um, usually it's the weight off the floor. Once I get past that knee, I, I'm usually good. Cool. Uh, so front squats, same thing. We actually, Someone, people have commented before how your squat stance is so narrow. Um, and so we took it out a little bit in her front squats, but the back squat is always oh, hurting your hip, right? Yes, both sides. Yeah, so we ended up staying with a super narrow back squat stance. She's just stronger, more comfortable. There's only so much you can do about that. There's no point in like killing somebody to make it look perfect. Um, but you can see here some Zotz presses, pressing clean, whatever you want to call them. Definitely much better mobility, even though she almost fell over right there. Mm -hmm. It's going to happen. Um, so if you go back and look at old video, there's just no way she was sitting in that way. So she does a lot of ankle stretching at the beginning of her workout. Um, same one I always use, just sit people in the squat, lean all their weight on, on the one knee, close that ankle. Um, what? How, how long have you been lifting? It's been, gosh, six Seven years, 2007. And you learned where, college? In college, Sacramento State. Yes, so what, uh, and then you took some time off, right? Took some time off, had a couple injuries here and there. Back Hi. injury. <laughs> what, what happened with the back? Um, it was L4, L5, treating this. A little more push up the legs. Shots, took some time off. Oh boy. So is that, Push. that's been all fine now? It's been great. Cool. And it's all the ab work, right? It's all the ab work. There you go. And your favorite. Everyone out there. Your favorite good mornings. Yes. Danielle acts like good mornings are the hardest exercise ever made. Even if she's just done like a thousand cleans and back squats, you get to good mornings and it's like she's getting go. tortured to death. What's, what's the story with that? They're hard. <laughs> They're hard, and I'm tired. <laughs> and then, uh, so we've been doing some riser pulls. Uh, for her, it's a smaller riser. You can see that's just two three-quarter inch pieces there, so about an inch and a half. Because, like she said, she's 4'11", so it's kind of unfair to put her on the same riser that someone at 5'11 uses, like me. Mm -hmm. uh, but that the whole idea is that to get that the strength off the ground. Uh, she kind of mentioned earlier that, that pull off the floor can get really tough. 
Um, so you'll see her pull off the floors a little slow sometimes, and all of a sudden she just blows up at the top. So as long as she's confident with that, everything's fine. Yeah. And then uh, here's your favorite power. You don't have to squat. Oh, wait. No, you do. So, and tell people what goes on with your gr uh, your uh, overhead position sometimes when it starts just going backwards. Uh, I'm diving forward. Yeah. Basically, so. And, but is that ha has that always been a problem? It for has. You? It has. Um, <laughs> can't explain it. It's just horrible because yeah, she'll no, throw that bar up there thing. so easy, and then all of a sudden, I think it, right at the start of this video, there was one that just kept going. So what's going on in your head when that bar starts going backwards? Besides, no, 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 no. Just hold on to it. It's like a fix it. As it gets heavier. All right, here comes some jerks. She's going to show you how to jerk like a, like a seminar right there. So that one, the second one a little too far back. Same kind of thing sometimes with the, the jerk is she'll dive her head through, her hips go back, and then the arms go back a little too far. So much more consistent. What's your best now, 94? Uh, yes, 94. 94 kilos, and basically jerked 95 about 20 times the other, uh, the other day. Do you have jerks today? Uh, Thursday. Thursday, all Tomorrow. right. So next time you talk to, to yeah. us, we're gonna have a 95 kilo jerk, yes. guaranteed. Uh, anything else you wanna add for the fine people at home on YouTube land? No. <laughs> no, nothing at all. Nothing at all. What's the big plans? What's the next meet? Next meet, it's November 1st and 2nd. Good. It's what? Golden West? So I think so. Have, uh, Kevin's meet? Yes. Which I don't know what that's called. What is it called? I'm calling it the Fake American Open. Okay, the Fake American Open. I don't know if there's another name for it. And then wrap it up with some push presses, which you love too, right? Love these. So good. Good good for her shoulders that always hurt. I'll wrap it up there. All right. Thank you, Danielle. Thank you. Hope you guys learned so much and still love us. Talk <laughs> to you next time.